Louisville police say juveniles are connected to multiple carjackings across the city. WDRB's Fallon Glick tells us thieves crashed one of those cars into a church. This is the aftermath of an overnight crime spree. I'm not surprised at all. Smashed pieces of a car crashed into Pleasant View Baptist Church in the Parkland neighborhood. The car appears to have crashed into the sign out front, then landed at the front doors. Dirt still scattered across the glass. It is very unfortunate, yes. LMPD says several juveniles were arrested after this crash, connected to four armed carjackings across the city. And it's really sad because, you know, people, it takes a lot to get a car and maintain it and repair it or find it and replace it. So, yeah, it's really sad to see all of this happening. Courtney Richardson lives in one of the areas hit overnight. Police say three carjackings happened in Fern Creek. Two on Hames Trace and about a mile away there was another on Newbridge Place. The fourth carjacking happened in Middletown on Brattle Court. I've been a victim. Um, my car window was shot out um, a couple of years ago over here. I mean, I think if people maybe valued their own thing, you know, things they have themselves, and w when you work hard for something you yourself, you kind of have a different value in things. Police say there have been 98 carjackings so far this year. That is down from 150 last year. In 2021, there were 248, 212 carjackings in 2020, and 81 in 2019. Yeah, I don't know how people do this. You know, people, like I said, work so hard for what you have and just for someone to steal it, and there's nothing you can do about it. Fallon Glick, WDRB News.